Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and a question that I have from time to time and I got it again um, this week. And of course, uh, it's been a long time since I've talked about it, but we're going to link it a little bit to what I was saying with the video that uh, I made about antivirus and why you should not rely on antivirus to um, you know, protect you. So it's the, the story behind it is, is for the same reason. A lot of people have noticed that their Windows security app or Windows Defender gets security intelligence updates for Defender antivirus, sometimes several times a day. And the question that came is, well, is something wrong with my antivirus? Why are there so many updates? Um, well, it's very simple. Uh, I told you that uh, in the antivirus video, there were literally thousands of new video, uh, new uh, viruses or new malware every single week. And that means that antivirus to actually do something to, to work, they need to adapt to all the new ones and the new variants as fast as they can. As I told you, most of them fail really to do it well, and that's why you don't rely on antivirus, because there's too many viruses and malware you won't recognize and will not block. Once again, anybody thinking yours is better than any other, you don't know what you're talking about. You don't understand security. It, it ain't true. There is no antivirus that's better than another. Uh, that is bogus. And when I see websites that say, hey, we did antivirus tests, and here's our results, uh, you know what? Remember that all these websites are paid and have ads for antivirus in there. So they have to talk about it and test them out and try to tell you that one is better than the other when it reality doesn't change anything. So because of the really large number of new uh, malware out there, they, of course, are constantly updating the list of malware, the way to detect it. So they have signatures, what we call. A signature is simply a line of code that is in a specific malware. So if a new virus comes out today, you'll have a signature. There's a part of that code that when it, you come across it, you know it's that virus. And so as long as that line of code isn't modified, that it stays the same, what's going to happen is that you're going to get an update in your antivirus. It's going to update the signatures of tons of viruses that it, that are brand new or that have been modified, old ones that now have new code, so that when your antivirus touches it, it actually is capable of recognizing a virus by seeing that it has the same code base. So that's why you might get two, three, four, five updates sometimes in a day of the security intelligence update for Microsoft Defender. Um, if you have a third-party antivirus that is either free or paid, they actually have the same amount of updates every day. It's just that it's done behind the scenes. You don't notice it. The software just updates by itself when it has a new update, but you don't see it. Uh, in the days when computers had you know, less power and the antivirus was uh, bogging down systems, because for a long time there was such a thing as there, I'm sure there is still such a thing, but on newer machines that are so powerful, it probably doesn't show as much. But uh, back in the day when computers were actually slower, you could actually see when an update was being done because it would actually slow down the overall machine. So uh, it's normal to have updates to your antivirus several times a day. Um, that's the way it will actually be um, giving you the best performance and hopefully detecting something if you ever do something bad. Because, once again, if it detects a virus, it's because you are, at the time of detection, doing something you should not have done. It's as simple as that. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.